Yeah, I did. Okay. We got fresh bull testicles. Uh, they were cut today. My setup, I got a bucket with just ice. I've rinsed them several times. I've got a trash bucket, and my, my kid's screaming. I've got a trash bucket. I've also got, these are just salted ice water, and this is a full one over here. But salted ice water. When they're done, they're gonna look something like that. They've got two layers of skin on them. You don't wanna eat the skin. These actually have a lot of hair too. But, so I found a pretty quick and easy way. The way I get them, testicle, this is like the, I don't know if that's the vas deferens or what the heck that is. But you can feel the end of the nut right there. I lay it down and I wanna take this side of it, I take just a little bit of the nut off too. This is tricky because it wants to wash around in your hand. Um, so I take a little bit of the nut off and you'll know you did it when you see that real chickeny flavor or colored meat. So I just turned it inside out. You saw me just kind of turn that exterior skin off. And then there's this little jobber and then skin and all this attached. We don't want this skin either. And a lot of people will cut that off and it's an extra step I don't think you need. So I keep the thing going and rinse it. A sharp knife helps. This is, it started out sharp. I use this as a handle. Just score that until you see it open up and then run your knife all along it and you want to go all the way to the back to right there give it a rinse flip it around now we're just going to basically undress it and by doing that you'll grab a, a hold of that little piece of skin right there like yay and then just start peeling it back with your hand. I use the back of this finger to really put pressure against it because it's a real kind of flaky meat and it'll stick to that skin if you don't, if you're not diligent enough to scrape it. You get down to a certain point and then I use the same thing. Skin, give it a rinse. One nut, ready to go. This, all this mess, trash bucket.